Welcome to our new presentation. Our selected topic for today is blood pressure. In this video, we will discuss about our blood pressure categories or classification of blood pressure or types of hypertension. In our previous videos, we have discussed about normal blood pressure, systolic blood pressure, diastolic blood pressure. How does your blood pressure change with aging? How often should you get your cholesterol checked? How to get your cholesterol tested? What should your blood pressure is according to age and how to lower blood pressure without medicine? The links of all those videos are on the description, you can watch those. Welcome once again to our nursing exercise channel. If this is your first time here, we have a YouTube channel that aims to enrich your knowledge about your health, fitness, medication, nutrition, diet, etc. And if it is your plan to update yourself about these important issues for all of the important tips, advice, discussion and presentation, make sure to subscribe to our channel and click on our notification bell icon. Let's start our presentation. What does blood pressure categories mean? Blood pressure measures the force with which blood is pressing against the walls of blood vessels. To manage your blood pressure, you need to know which blood pressure categories are ideal and which ones is cause for concern. Following are the blood pressure ranges used to diagnose normal blood pressure and hypertension in adults. What is the classification of hypertension? The five blood pressure ranges as recognized by the American Heart Association are explained in the below. 1. Normal blood pressure a blood pressure reading has a top number systolic and bottom number diastolic. Blood pressure numbers of less than 120 over 80 mm of mercury are considered within the normal range. 2. Elevated blood pressure Elevated blood pressure is when readings consistently range from 120 to 129 systolic and less than 80 mm of mercury diastolic. People with elevated blood pressure are likely to develop high blood pressure unless steps are taken to control the condition. 3. Hypertension Stage 1 Hypertension stage 1 is when blood pressure consistently ranges from 130 to 139 systolic or 80 to 89 mm of mercury diastolic. At this stage of high blood pressure, doctors are likely to prescribe lifestyle changes and may consider adding blood pressure medication based on your risk of atherosclerotic cardiovascular disease ASCVD, such as heart attack or stroke. 4. Hypertension Stage 2 Hypertension Stage 2 is when blood pressure consistently ranges at 140 over 90 mm of mercury or higher. At this stage of high blood pressure, doctors are likely to prescribe a combination of blood pressure medications and lifestyle changes. 5. Hypertensive Crisis this stage of high blood pressure requires medical attention. If your blood pressure readings suddenly exceed 180 over 120 mm of mercury, wait 5 minutes and then test your blood pressure again. If your readings are still unusually high, contact your doctor immediately. You could be experiencing a hypertensive crisis. If your blood pressure is higher than 180 over 120 mm of mercury and you're experiencing signs of possible organ damage such as chest pain, shortness of breath, back pain, numbness, weakness, change in vision or difficulty speaking, do not wait to see if your pressure comes down on its own. Immediately visit to your doctor. If you have any query, please comment in the comment box and if you enjoy watching our videos please subscribe our channel to receive notifications every time we upload a new video. Hit the bell icon twice. Thanks for watching.